units en route to Waco High. A call to Waco Police Department Tuesday afternoon sent officers in a hurry to help secure Waco High School and save lives. We've only gotten the one call so far. We have notified Waco ISD. Waco police say an unknown caller said there was an active shooter on campus and students were injured. We did try and call back the phone number that showed on the admin line and it shows to be rejected. As police got to the scene around two o'clock, they noticed school was going on as normal. People walking around normal. Security is not aware of anything. They haven't heard anything. Are we sure this is not a prank call? Our officers were immediately on scene, and once they got to the scene, got to Waco High, they were realizing that this was probably not a credible threat. After checking and clearing every single room on campus, CTE building is clear. Waco police say no guns were found and definitely no shots fired. They work day in and day out with different active uh, threat trainings, and so this is one of the reasons why we do those trainings. And thankfully this time it, there was not a credible threat. Waco ISD launched a reunification process at base at the Extraco Event Center after they were given the all clear. We take this very seriously anytime there's a threat to students or staff. Everybody knew what to do and, and it, thankfully everybody did their part today and we got through it as quickly as possible. Yeah. As other active shooter threats happened in South Texas, Waco PD is looking to see if it could possibly be connected to the one at Waco High. So we're not sure what that means regarding this incident, but right now our biggest concern was the safety for our for the students and our and our community.